Today we will review the Nico Automated Preservation System, exclusively for use with the Myriad Novus Resection Device. This combination provides non-ablative, non-thermal resection with automated collection and biological preservation of tissue. Depending on your facility's objectives, there are a few ways the APS system can be set up. The intent of this option is to provide specimen collection and immediate refrigeration while mitigating the accumulation of clotted blood inside the collector. The necessary items will be Myriad Novus with handpiece, APS pack, lactated ringers, sterile IV spike set, and additional specimen collectors or infusion valve sizes based on the goals of the procedure. Step 1. Fill the basin inside the preserver with ice, leaving 1 to 2 centimeters of space at the top of the container. Step 2. Secure the lid and place it in the holder on the Myriad Novus cart. Step 3. Pull the arrow tab to activate the temperature monitoring feature. Step 4. A blue light indicates the preserver is maintaining a temperature at or below 8 degrees Celsius, and an orange flashing light indicates the preserver temperature is above 8 degrees Celsius. Step 5. Connect the specimen collector to the end of the handpiece tubing and to the canister, and place into the holding slot in the preserver. Step 6. Connect the 0.76 mm infusion valve to the sterile point break found on the handpiece tubing. The line should be separated a bit to allow for the valve to be inserted without kinking. Step 7. Connect the sterile spike set tubing to the Y valve of the infusion valve. Step 8. Once the spike set is passed out of the sterile field, connect a bag of LR. Place the bag at the patient level. Step 9. The flow rate should be adjusted with the roller valve on the spike set to provide a flow rate that is dilutive, not full or heavy, to keep any blood from clotting. The APS system is now ready for use. The specimen collector can create a sealed, fluidic environment by connecting the suction fitting to the lid of the collector. Once ready for handling in the lab, twist the lid clockwise to remove the filter. With the APS, Automated tissue collection and biological preservation are now a reality while in the operating suite.